everything will be okay. <laughs> What's up guys, it's Dylan for Floating World. I'm out here with the one and only, the fucking legend himself, DJ Fat. Look, fly as fat DJ from the east to the west, man. I'm losing weight, I ain't even the f flattest, flyest nigga. I'm just a fly nigga. I'm still flying on a lot of y'all niggas. From we in Texas though. Feel me, everything bigger than the hoe out this bitch. You feel mm. me, and I'm with gang, so, you know? Where you from? Uh, New Jersey. New Jersey, you feel me? East Coast, Tri-State. You know, I love my, I love, I love my area. I love Jersey. Is that where you started, like DJing and everything? Yeah, I started DJing in, in Elizabeth, in, in in Elizabeth and Newark. Like, Newark is the, uh, the capital of Jersey, I think. Yeah, type shit. And if you know what I'm saying, if you know about Newark, then you, you know about Newark. And shit is, you know what I'm saying? It's wild out there. You feel me? If you ain't got a pass, don't even pass around. You know what I'm saying? Type right. shit. What made you get into DJing? What made you decide to start doing that? Uh, my best friend at the time in high school, he was an artist. And, uh, like, I remember one day, like, all right, so if niggas don't know me from DJ, being DJ Fat, they know me from just being a fly nigga in general. Like, in school, I always had Jordans and whatever the case may be. But um, I was just on top of everything. And, uh, bruh, bruh was a rapper. I seen them fly nigga in school, had the latest Air Maxes on. I bought a mixtape from him. Took the mixtape back home, had my mom drive me around and listen to that hoe, and I'll never forget to tell my mom, like, for me, whatever that nigga need, I'ma help him, for me? And it just so happened that he needed, you know what I'm saying, me to DJ for him, for me, I started DJ for him. He the one, he was the nigga to tell me to, like, make that tag, the, the Flies Fat DJ, I did that shit with him and his room, really, for me? So, that shit just pushed me to be this. And also just like, and just loving music in general, just knowing music before it, like it's time, literally what I do, you know, like bring everybody to the, to the, you know what I'm saying, to to the, you know, the artists, whatever the case may be, whatever I like, it could be. And y'all, if y'all follow me, y'all know it's like, I'm gonna put y'all on these, and nigga, music, clothes, nigga, the latest weed, nigga, the latest everything, like, you feel me? Cause I'm just outside them, you feel me? I'm living this shit day by day, you feel me? And back then, like, when you were in the car playing that mixtape with your mom, like, did you ever expect to be where you are now, like, traveling the U.S. and, like, making Hell moves no. and shit? Hell no. I knew it was going to happen, but not with, off the strength of that choice I made that day in that car, you feel me? Like, yeah. like... Hell no, I don't even think about that, you feel me? That shit crazy. I never thought I would have left Jersey. It was, you feel me? Me doing this music shit was the first time that, like, it allowed me to leave Jersey and go somewhere. My first time ever leaving Jersey, I went to Austin, you feel me? Yeah. For a South by Southwest. You dj Yeah, that shit changed my life, bro. I'll never forget, I was at the Wendy's right by the where, like, the South by Southwest street is, Main Street, whatever. Sixth Street. Sixth Street. Yeah. And he like walked up to me and was like, bro, you DJ fat? And I'll never forget that shit. Cause nigga, that was 2016. Yeah. I ain't even have nothing much out, you feel me? So was, that clicked right there. Like I quit my job that year, that same year. I'm like, nah, shit. niggas know, bro, you feel me? That shit is a blessing, bro. Nah, so I like all of y'all, I love everybody that should support DJ fat. Like, you know, like, you feel me? Y'all treat me like a rapper. I'm just, you feel me? I'm just, I'm just a regular guy. Hey, and what's what's up with the triple cup? Most people they usually be rocking the double. Why you got three? My shit's so muddy. My it's gonna leak so through. Potent. Like you gotta make sure this mo this motherfucker good. But no, nah, I just like everything I gotta do is gotta be a little like tweaked up. You feel me? So like I'm gonna come different. I always come hella cup. Just in, you might need a cup. I'm gonna give you a cup. You never know. Might pull your ass up. You feel me? Everything everything I do gotta be like turned up a notch. Like niggas got the this ain't it, but like you see the Yuri shot. Yuri Break down Sport. the fit real quick. Break down the fit. Right, so look, Yuri Sport, you feel me? This shit, hundred dollars. Go hit up Yuri on Instagram. Yuri Sport, uh, Lone Ranger, one on one shirt. He gave this shit to me yesterday. I modeled it, and then I was like, as soon as he took the piece out, he showed it to me. As I put it on, and I already knew in my head I'm not taking it off. You know? uh, Rick Owens, some nice like waxed Rick Owens. Feel me, some, some not some shit you see all these other niggas in. You feel me? I always mm -hmm. wear some Rick that no no nigga got. And then uh, the good Vism, the Vism sandals. You feel me? Y'all niggas is rocking C C Coke, whatever. Y'all rocking the, the the shit in the mall. This is, you know what I'm saying? The the reason why they start making these type of sandals. You feel me? The brand that started it all. Yeah. 
I mean, shout out to Yams and the Europeans. This is, you know what I'm saying? This is Bozy. It's a Bozy fit. You feel me? I got one last question for you. What's good? Talk to me, bro. Right, I'm kind of in a rough spot, bro. You think you can give me like two dollars? I was waiting for somebody to do that, man. I got you two dollars if you really need it. Shit, I think DJ Fat need to give me two dollars, bro. I'm not gonna lie. But I just, I just need a cup of lean, bro. You know what I'm saying? How much you want, man? Oh, yeah, what are you doing asking for two dollars, bro? What you doing out here, man? They over here trying to extort me, bro. You know, you know, Fat ain't ever asked for no two damn dollars. That shit was fake. Come on, bro. It's faker than. Bro, it's faker than fake, bro. Look, look, what two dollars gonna help fat dude? Uh, Come on, bro. Y'all uh, tripping, bro. Y'all tripping. <laughs> and then the next nigga to ever ask me is gonna get slapped. That's so, crazy. You, That's you, crazy. You interview, so it's different, bro. Hey, yeah, I appreciate they, you. They be trying to do that to someone, man. Hey, the legend himself, DJ Fat, bro. Floating world, tap in. It's my boy right here. Gang. Dallas, Texas. How you liking Dallas, by the way? This shit like my third home. So I love being here. I, every time I come here, I end up never leaving. And I'm always here for like, you feel me, for a good amount of time. So the people one so last happened. message. It just so happened that this time we linked up with Josh and now we getting shit together. You feel me? So okay. shout out Josh and then shout out to Flow in the World USA. What uh, you got to say to the people, people before they leave? Bro, live your fucking life, YOLO. Don't, don't get your head, don't dwell in the negativity, don't dwell into what the world wants you to think, bro. Do, you, do, your, do, your, do your own shit, bro. The world is in the palm of your hands. Right now, y'all in my world, you feel me? Y'all gonna see what the fuck I'm gonna do, you feel me? What I want you to do, I watch me do, do it, is make sure you know what you wanna do and go ahead and do that shit, you feel me? Cause nothing's stopping y'all, you feel me? So, you feel me? I'm just living in my dreams. Feel me and turn it into reality. Anybody could do it. I'm sure you, you, you know what I'm saying? You do it. Josh be doing that shit. Everybody be doing that shit. So, you feel me? Please, bro. Get to it, please. Professor Fat out here, man. Taking y'all to class for real. I appreciate it, man. Yes, sir. Cool. Awesome.